inside of the car. I know. Grid life. Again. Again. This is just a track day at Autobahn we're going to this weekend. Um, welcome to the Afterburner blog vlog. Blog vlog? Blog vlog. I'm Brad. This is Derek. This is our parents' van. Welcome we, to the minivan. Welcome to the minivan. I don't know why it has life jackets in it. Two of them that don't fit. They don't fit anybody. They don't fit um, anybody. We are heading to our grandparents' house to pick up a generator because Audubon has no hookups for camping. So yeah, we are going to Auto. At, did I say that? I don't know. Yeah, well, we're going to said. Audubon Country Club. Yeah, there you go. In Joliet. 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 In Joliet. The place where the Blues Brothers start. We're, go, we're going to Joliet, Illinois. State yeah. Illinois. The State Penitentiary is there. Uh, <laughs> Uh, right by Chicago Land Speedway, we're gonna go there. This this bloke is driving the Mazda. Should have been the BMW. I'm doing nothing besides shooting photos and no video. Shooting video, that's what you're doing. Shooting and video. Keep taking chart, keeping track of these. Keeping track of these. Yeah. Brendan is doing media. Brendan. And <laughs> <laughs> he shoots film and that's it. What is a media? We're gonna have like 30 photos from him. Um, I'm gonna let him use the Sony whenever I'm not using it. Because, like, there, there's a uh, couple times every day where I have, like, a two-hour gap between sessions. Right. So I'll have so, time to peruse. And then we need to pick the generator up tonight. It's Friday. Yeah, it's Friday. Saturday's the event. 6.41 p.m. PM Eastern Standard Time. Hmm. And we're leaving tomorrow early. Early. Interesting. Not so much. Sit rep. Currently stuck behind a trailer with a ton of hay on it. Shit ton. Sh ton of hay. I don't know. Uh, what's that piece of metal there? You can get around. I believe it's being pulled by a tractor. Nope. It's no, an it's F250. Get pulled by a chick. Did you do it? Did you it? That sucked. Yeah. We're almost there. Yeah. Almost. Uh, 752. Almost there, maybe. Right. Generator acquired. Now that we have way too much power. Now we have way too much power to power my computer. And, and charge all our devices. Charge things. We have way afterburn. Too, way too much power. It's way. so afterburn. This Great. thing is like built to run entire houses and run like really, really high electricity like welding equipment and we're using it to charge phones and camera batteries. <laughs> Wrecked! <coughs> so afterburner. On the way back to Casa del Afterburner. Yeah. Dude's camping. Dude's camping in a field. So, uh, it's, it's Friday night. It's almost 9 o'clock. It's almost 9 o'clock. We're an hour and a half from We're home. We're an hour and a half from home. I've yet to pack for when we're leaving at 6 a.m. tomorrow. Let's do this. late.
Yeah, I'm, my tent's media, or we're just we're gonna keep our equipment. And I might sleep in there too, so. I might sleep in there too. Media tent, no girls allowed. So, welcome to, not Ginger Man, but Audubon Country Club. Is it Joliet, Illinois? Uh, this is our this is our site. We are racing today, for the first time ever on an actual racetrack. Afterburner is participating in. Took us a while. Took us a while, but we're here. We made it, Mom. We made it. We made it, Mom. I passed. We passed Derek. Passed Tech. Somehow. A okay. I think it was probably just cool enough to where they let it slide. Probably. Shh, we don't say anything. He's number one Lem because lazy tech guys. Yeah. <laughs> Good enough. Um, we got sleep tent set up, media tent. We got the truck. So We're getting the generator set up right now. So. But. The, do the jacks need to be on there though? I have extra space, okay? Good news is we have a nice piece of road to work in the car if we have to. The grass is all right. We don't want the jacks sinking in. I'm gonna get the truck out for tonight. Out? For tonight. So we go into town. Oh. oh. No, there's no back seat. Did you not, do you remember filming the feature video for it? Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I was laying in the back. Yeah, but do we really want to be driving through Chicago? And plus, if Pat and them come, they're not coming today. Oh really? Oh really? No spectators today? Okay. Which means I won't have any trouble uh, getting away with things. So, for right now, still getting things set up. I gotta pee really bad. Uh, back power. So this round of grid life is interestingly set up in that. Today, on Saturday, spectators aren't allowed here, is that true? Yeah. No spectators today on Saturday. So, just racing. Um, but there'll be, be tons of people here tomorrow, because... Wait, let's go, is that a Laurel? No, it's just... But whatever, but back to what I was saying, it, Offset Kings is here tomorrow, right? Yeah. Okay, just so tomorrow? just tomorrow. Just tomorrow. So Offset Kings stands car show. Mm -hmm. and the car show. And the drifting's tomorrow. And the drifting. No drifting today? No drifting. Today. Jo no drifting today, drifting tomorrow. Pace cars and a rotary. What is this? Is this Maxima? There's two of them, whatever it yeah, is. Maxima. These are pretty rad. I like these, these are cool. So. Oh, that's a brand new one. Hey Derek. What the, uh, what do you think you can get a used one of those for? Not that much. Probably like 90? Brand, brand new one. Brand new ones are like, they, they gotta be like 200 for a brand new one, dude. Well, I mean, still. Think about think about the buy-in price for a race car, though. That's still relatively inexpensive. Right, so. Radical's out on track right now because this is a country club, and people are part of said country club to have expensive race cars because this is Chicago. If you have the means to join Audubon Country Club, live in the Chicago area. I highly recommend it. It's don't. choice. It's choice. It has bread. Do you, do you think Abe Froman's a member here? Yeah, of course he is. I'm the sure. Sausage King of Chicago. He is Abe Froman. Is definitely a member here. He has the money. He has the means. Um, so, anyways, it's set up like this is a little like paddock area, and that's the main building up there. It looks like it looks like it's a farm. <laughs> but that being said, this is the main area. There's like a. It's in the middle of an industrial area, like Chicago and Speedway. Speedway is like behind that big old ass white building over there. That's where like the main the teams that have a bunch of money built like garages and stuff to keep the cars here. That's uh, you can that's just cool. So you better go to that mate. Well, we should we need to go to that too, don't we? Chris said we Chris said we should show up at the drivers meeting.
couple of things in place. We're going to be watching you guys. Um, we want you guys to watch out for each other and make sure that uh, you know we don't have any incidents into it. Um, you know, as far as the, the schedule goes, I'm sure you guys all, all looked at it. But just as a reminder, we're going to be running North Pole course first, and we'll get into how you grid for that and some of the details of the track a little bit later. But, um, but um, there's going to be two sessions for everybody on North. So uh, look at North as kind of your Another thing to note is that we've got about 30 drivers, 32 drivers per session, um, which is great for full course, it's great for south course, it's a little bit tight for north. So uh, north course uh, is really the gateway to the opportunity to run full course all the way into the dark. A lot of our a lot of our events that I know a lot of you guys have ran have been on south course, so just look at north as figuring it out a little bit. Um, the main thing with the schedule today is we need to stick to it.
4.22 local time. Um, finished up the first two track sessions of the day on the north course over there. Um, I had a lot of fun so far. Um, just got done with our driver's meeting and our the other beginner's meeting before we switched to the full course for three more sessions this afternoon. And one thing I do want to show you guys is he's been passed out for like four hours.